Hello everybody and welcome back to the long war. So we have a crest fighter today and I have a problem. I'm building my engineers a bit bad because I don't have repair on that many. Uh, but anyways, we have our assault opera. Joe is our engineer. We have Advanjala Cow as our rocketeer and also I promoted her to lieutenant so we have her as the officer. We have Laken, our sniper with the uh, disabling shot. We have uh, Havefloss as our scout. We have Friendly as our medic. And Chunha is our gunner. And Lemar is our assault. This is the guy that survived the base assault. So, the base defense. And he ha has one charge of arc thrower here if we get a chance to capture someone. So, the problem is that. We might not get uh, the France is sending an urgent mission request. Power source. The alien craft went down in flames. We've pinpointed its final resting place in a rural area with no significant civilian population. We need to secure that craft and eliminate any. I'm not sure how I will be able to get free power supplies. Power plants for my research. <laughs> And that's bad because we need Titan armor and stuff. We're just north of the crash site. Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear, big sky. How do you look like we'll this? Monitor those readings from here. Switch. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. Oh, okay. We have uh, Shunha has the distortion field. Interesting. Is this a cell wall? All right. So we actually start in the corner here. Aye, aye, commander. Let's go conceal here. I'm tempted to use the motion tracker. Let's do it. Right. We'll go. go for this meld. Alien object in sight. Okay. It's a bit strange that it's so close to the zone wall. Anyways, this uh, enables us to dash all the way. Ten four. Which is nice, I guess. Um, okay. Don't need to dash with the. Uh, do this. Sniper though. Ass. Yeah, I'm not sure about having will to survive on the engineers. I feel like that's a bad choice. I should stop doing it, but we'll see. Double time. Because copy, I mean, repair at the same time, repair isn't that great uh, if you're not going to capture aliens. It doesn't really matter that much, but. You can never capture too many aliens in this. Uh... Is that a uh, sectopod? Or is it just a mechtoid? I'm sure hoping that it's just a mechtoid. Okay, we are actually at the UFO already. Which is kind of strange. So this area isn't that big, well it's kind of big, I guess, but we dashed a lot, so that's why we have gotten all the way. I'm on it, Commander. Right. Okay. Mm. Location confirmed. Yeah. Bringing two assaults might have been a bad choice as well. Understood. Moving out. We need to get our rocketeer on the move. really close. At least we have the ghost long rifle if we it, have to deal with sector pods. I'm not sure if you can hear the difference between sector pods and the mechtoids. Should uh, start seeing them soon. Heading there now. It's been secured. Oops. Right. So I will not go for the UFO. That should be. Oh, 
outside there since it was just a single single unit. Heading to that location. Heading to that location. But uh, we don't really have anyone that can take a hit from okay. the sector pod. I guess our uh, old salt and our scout can take On one shot, but preferably not. Now we have to decide if we want to stay on the high ground here or if we want to move with our squad. Move. Let's move with our squad. I think it's the best. We need to hear something else than that freaking uh, sector pod. Because that scares me. Alright, so we... Sure about this. Heading to that location. Heading to that location. Mm. On the move. Yeah, this is bad. Roger, Dodger. Copy that. We really need Titan armor. Roger that. Come in. Roger that. Uh, I guess that uh, our uh, scout shouldn't be on our watch. Yeah, we are hearing the outsider now. Moving. What? <laughs> I'm happy we have the concealment though. Almost makes me feel safe. Almost. Moving out. I also need to build some of this uh, special ammunition for aye, aye, my shotguns that will bypass some of the damage reductions. Moving. Let's get our rocket here into this Affirmative. position Moving instead. Out. Heading there now. I remember how hard the sector pods were um, the first time you met them, and then for the long war, and <laughs> not the long war, but uh, hmm, I'm to run over here. Running. What? Why isn't that covered? Um, but then in the enemy within, they added like uh, minus 50% damage taken on top of already high hit points. We don't have any... That's the biggest problem I guess, but we do not have any acid grenades. So that will take quite some time to get through all the HP. What the hell was that? Right. Let's try to conceal ourselves this time. This is really strange. Mm. YOLO! Problem is our scout is uh, <laughs> too quick for us. I'm on the move. To keep up. Hey there now. Aye aye, Commander. Heading out. I'm on the move. Moving. Oh well. Heading to that location. So said the weapon. Said 
the weapon. The problem is that we never see where the sound comes from. The stompy... Stompy sounds. This is the sound wall, so we should be safe to dash over here. One thing is uh, that uh, to that XCOM 2 is coming out soon, and uh, I'm wondering how that will feel. Like, I mean, it feels like we will miss so much from uh, the way. long war. Things like uh, that we have uh, eight soldier classes, and also the fact that. Uh, in every rank, we get three different uh, things Quiet. to choose from. Did you hear something? While in XCOM 2, it seems like we will get five soldiers, soldier types, soldier classes, and we will only get uh, two upgrades to choose from for every level up. This is so strange, I mean... Are they camping the UFO? Headed there now. Don't trigger anything now, please. This almost feels like when Headed I played the uh, Xenonauts. Position confirmed. Looking for the aliens and then getting more and more impatient and then... Making uh, silly mistakes. Position. Right, we need to get uh, the sniper on top here because we have this hill in the way if we had to fight in this area. So we, we need to get him into a better position. Gunner, sure. <laughs> Small, small steps. I mean, come on, give me an indication where that stomping is coming from. That's one big group. Maybe two groups at even. Is this one group or is it two groups? What? Do we want to get the sniper into position? Let's do it. Oh, now we can see. Where is Mechtoid? Okay, it doesn't say anything scary about him. So that's good. Who else do you need to get into firing position? Our Rocketeer needs to get into fire position as well. Which isn't that easy. <laughs> Maybe I should move you back here so I can get the suit. Okay, can only shoot two guys from there, but. At least now we can get a bit here. here. Friendly. Should have a gunner somewhere as well. Orders confirmed on the move. Mm, Moving. The swords can just move around the side, I guess. The medic can be in between, and we need to have. Mm, how about this assault? Um, 
This isn't actually closer, but... Come on, one of these guys should be patrolling. Nope. Right, who can you shoot? How about that rocket? Quite bad scatter, let's uh, use steady weapon first. Is that uh, we will be easily flanked here? Well, we got there, but right. don't trigger anything on this side. All right, mm. Mr. Assault. Here. It's fine. So the weapon for friendly. Uh, I guess the weapon for you. I'll watch for you. And uh, pass. Right. Rockets away. Shredder rocket or damage rocket? Let's go with damage rocket, that's fine. Boom! Boom. My rocketeers has so bad aim though. Look sharp. Enemies out. Did one, one sectoid survive? <laughs> kind of think so. You can't fire at that guy. The thing is, I want to capture the sectoid because I don't think we have any sectoids captured yet. Feels like a waste to take this shot. Fifteen HP. Yeah, we got that uh, cover bonus uh, dashing thingy, so 0% chance to hit. Right. What? Now we can shoot him with uh, the sniper? Strange. Whoa. So how do we capture that guy? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, Hugo, he's not even very quick. Already there. Kill this guy as well. 
I'm not sure if this is close enough. Right, at least you can suppress that guy. <clears throat> so 50% chance. Damn it. It. So the reason I'm doing this is because I don't want to flank this guy. I mean, I could just have taken this shot with um, with you, but uh, what I want to do is I want to use suppression until we can uh, capture him. So I don't want to flank him right now. So that's my plan. So let's get down here. Yes, sir. It take a couple of turns before <laughs> our slow assault is there, but. Hopefully we'll just tuck it down or something here. What? Or we'll take pot shots like that. That's uh, nasty. Press him again then. Copy that. Actually got shredded. Do you do they usually get shredded by suppression? I'm not sure. Let's go on a watch here so he has even less of a reason to move. either nope if it hits once more I will cry but I mean this is still just a 50 50 but uh, you have to try you have to try you have to try and you have to fail I guess Glenn is the one that needs kills the most. Right. So I actually think that was the only group. I'm on the move. Good to go. On my way. But yeah. I'm on the move. Not so bad that I didn't have an engineer with repair because that was uh, definitely a <laughs> capture. Oh well. I mean, I even have the disabling shot sniper, so. Find last uh, piece of the puzzle here. Um, concealment, that's <laughs> such a big thing. Oh, can't see him anymore. Usually, you can kind of see him. Yeah, here he is. So, I need to get my sniper like. Hmm. 
Maybe you should be able to get another side from here. I don't even care if I just start by shooting him with the, the sniper. I think that's fine. We didn't check uh, the power plant though. Like I said, I think it's busted. Also check his uh, abilities. Outside the engineer doesn't say anything about his stats. Maybe we need to trigger him first. If we could. Right, there he is. Let's get up here somewhere. Really? Soon in range for him to see me. Solid copy. Okay, yeah. That thing is busted. Yeah. Fifteen hit points, really? Quite impressive. Got a promotion already. Friendly doesn't do. really have it. So. Let's just hope we can finish him. He's only in half cover, so. And you should be able to flank him. Yeah. Let's hope that our low level guy can kill him. Up another one. He actually had a lot of damage resistance. Free damage reduction. I guess it's a shotgun, so it's a little bit higher than the usual, but still. We're certainly not leaving any question as to our ability to fight the alien threat. Excellent work all around, Commander. Yeah, but we needed to get the freaking power plant. Damn it. Anyways, uh, what kind of build is this? Kind of a high damage disabling shot build. Maybe have lock and load. Because uh, it's not that likely you will crit. And then we have high damage rocketeer. I guess shock and all. I'm not sure if uh, this extra rocket will lower the speed. I mean, getting extra conditioning might be good as well. I mean, it's not bad. Let's get try this. Let's see. It didn't say anything, so. Right. Um, you are going to go on suppression. Suppression with dangerous zone and mayhem. So maybe double tap. Kind of low aim. Rapid fire. Yeah, this is quite hard. I mean, this gives you more aim at least. But the thing is, you will not stand and just take ordinary shots because you will not have opportunists. So we will not really benefit from the Overwatch. I mean, double tap is kind of nice. Then you can add hollow targeting and shredder ammo for two targets. So let's go with that. 
Okay, what kind of a sword do we want to make you into? You're very average all around. Hmm. A tanky assault? Do I have a tanky assault? Like, uh, will to survive and silence. Hmm. Nah. I think I prefer to go ranger or aggression. Let's go with aggression. Yeah, those were damaged. Damn it. Is confident that within the last few months of her captivity, Exalt forces launched a direct assault on the aliens in order to recapture her for themselves. If what she's saying is true, Exalt is even more brazen and dangerous than we initially suspected. Right. So we got some alloys, which is good. Which we should spend to get something nice for ourselves. Like I'm not sure. Penetrator weapons. Mechanized unit defenses might be good if we're going to make ourselves some uh, mechs soon. A super sky ranger would be nice if you're going to attack the alien base, but the problem is that I kind of want to get titan armor, I think. You also use this uh, these alloys for just uh, building like uh, Gatling laser. Oh. This one, for example. No. Uh, I think ghost rifle. Nice as well. Yeah, we are in. This area where we will lack materials more than we lack uh, the money. Anyways, let's sell these things. Don't have enough money to sweep. I don't think we will have any exalts anyways. Do we need more ravens? I kind of think we need because we have satellites in four continents. But let's wait for the next month before ordering new ones. Well, let's scan. Aircraft transfer complete. Commander. We're receiving several urgent requests for assistance. It's a lot there of are money. in progress at each marked site on the Hologlobe. One or small, more small structures in a remote location. Okay, I'm not sure what this is all about. Um, do we have an engineer ready with the ability to capture guys? Not really. <laughs> also, my engineers are wounded. Oh well. Still can make a pretty strong squad. I also have new recruits here. I'm not sure where I got these guys from, but from some kind of mission, I guess. Well, that's fine. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, it's heavy activity. It might be hard. It might be easy. That depends on the types you get, but we will definitely get like uh, maybe heavy floaters and uh, hmm. yeah. Cyber discs and stuff. I think we should get the harder mission soon because the fighter were pretty easy. Mostly because we use a rocket to kill like 10 aliens at the same time, but still. But thanks you guys for watching, and I will see you again next time. Goodbye!